Hey, what's going on everybody? I hope you guys are doing well today. Hi, Tioli here and in this video, I got another Alliance Boss video as you can see from the title. It's a back-to-back -back video with my last video and in this video, I got a new strategy, man. Last video, I guaranteed you guys 200k points with that strategy and I know you guys could have easily got 300k with that. And in this video, you guys are gonna get even more points and this team is insanely easy to get. It's four epics and one legendary and I only swapped one person out. I swapped out mana for Baron J. Now, I swapped out mana for Baron J because I am willing to give up Chloe Van go going twice for another attacker. And he synchronizes with Chloe Van pretty damn well. I got six piece baron gear on him you already know because he's the boss baron j gear just like his name i just barely got him plus three yesterday and why he synchronizes well with chloe van is because his second skill reduces their magical defense so it allows him to do more damage and chloe van to do more damage and his ultimate skill is straight up a nuke it does so much damage and it will increase more if you have more weakening effects placed on him. So if if the if you have like Arslan or Alvita, you can definitely increase his damage. But my team is great without them. And you guys might not have them because you know they're legendary. Even though Arslan is pretty easy to get, Alvita is pretty hard. Now his skill gems, I got all these suggested sets. And they're all at 5 stars besides orange, which is at 4. Now his second skill, you can put on another indigo for sure, just to further increase that debuff. But I mean, you can have that blue if you want that bonus, and also it's just a little bit of damage. But right here, I'm going to put on another blue, man, just to further decrease that debuff. And yeah, man, without further ado, do, let's get right in the video. I got Weiwei, Baron J, Chloe Van, Cardia in the front, and in the back I got Miho, and we got Iron Wall Formation because I want Miho to give me a soul when she attacks. And you do not need an Alliance member with this team. No way. Let's get right into it. First off, we got Weiwei Attack Buff. After that, we got Chloe Van going, but you don't want to use any soul, so you just want to use her auto first. That did a lot of damage anyways. Oh man, so Miho did not give us a soul right there. But let's see if Baron J will. Nice. Baron J gave us a soul. That's cool. And I'm pretty sure that's a bonus from the BJ set. Right here, you, you don't want to use her skills first because you want to get Miho ultimate off as well as Cardia ultimate. So you're just going to forfeit that clo uh, way way attack buff, but it's all good. So we use Miho ultimate first to increase our critical rate. And she fucked us up right there, man. That's a shame. Look, Baron J can save us. If he gets a soul right here, nice, nice. Now Cardia can use her ultimate. See, things did not go our way for a little bit, but it's all good because we're right back on track. Now Chloe Van is gonna go off with her damage. I don't wanna use Miho's skills right now. I just wanna get as much damage off as possible in this stage. Baron J's second skill so we can get that defense down. I'm going to pull another card right here. Nice, that's almost my max. My max is at like 21k. I'm going to get way, way ultimate attack boost back on Chloe Van because, you know, we lost that. Get that ultimate off. Nice crit, man. 650k. Now look, the reason... You you guys don't know this, but before this, I legit recorded like four times, okay? Four times. And I had to scrap it because Chloe Van would not crit on her ultimate as well as Baron J. So my damage was just going down the drain. Now let me show you guys a Baron J ultimate, man. 
boom, 400K. We're already past 150K points, and it's only at rage 30%, dude. This is a good run. And then after this, I'm just going to increase the damage even more, the critical rate. Kind of salty uh, he evaded that shot, but at least he didn't evade my ultimate. So we're just going to increase attack even further. Get that Baron J off. Mm, 140k, and, and he evaded some. We are guaranteed to get more, da more points from this strategy. I've tested it out multiple times. And I can guarantee... It's going to get you more damage. Oh. No crit. No crit. Look, the thing is, I'm still going to get more damage by the end. Because we got Baron J. Even if Chloe Van fails, Baron J is going to swoop in and do damage. No cap. And Chloe Van still got that damage, you know? It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Oh. 600. Almost 700k. I honestly did not realize Baron J got that much damage on him. Honestly. He is doing more than Chloe Van. Get that attack boost back on so we can get that damage. Look, I'm at 450k and the rage is still at 70%. We're about to be our old video record right here. Right after this. Nice. 500k. Yo, so I want to take a moment to talk about that new hero with you guys that came out like two days ago. Listen, so I myself did not even pull any rubies from the banner, to be honest with y'all. Didn't even pull, okay? But you want to know what the funny thing is? I got the new hero. But and and I also recorded how I got it and I will probably put that video in the next summoning video because since I got that hero now, I'm not going to pull for her again, you know, so I'm going to wait until the next hero come out and then pull for that banner. Oh, man, he didn't crit, bro. That's crazy to me. I'm going to swap back to him so he can do more damage. Wow. No crit out here, bro. You better crit right here. Nice. Oh, whoa. Whoa. That was a million. That was a million. Yo, someone scroll back and confirm that that was actually a million damage. Because that would be absolutely insane. Straight up. Holy shit. If that was a million. Look, since this is our last turn, I'm not even going to use his buff. I mean, he didn't get no damage off, but. 400k, Chloe Van. Oh my god, you are out here. 300k, Baron J. Dude, they are doing so much damage right now. Nice. Almost 900k points. Very nice. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Hope you guys enjoy this strategy. We doubled our damage from the last video with one hero change, man. Well, that is it for this video for sure. 
I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. I'm not sure what it's gonna be yet. I wanna re release a hero guide because I know you guys really like that type of video. That series, I mean. But I also wanna put out an arena video for this season. So I'm gonna go to school in about 10 minutes and then drop a video or record an arena video right after school. But I'm going to try to get this uploaded this morning. So if I do, y'all already know that was magic. <laughs> but yeah, have a nice rest of the day. Use this strategy, man. I almost got a million points right there. If I would have min-maxed it better, I probably would have gotten a million points. But yeah, have a nice rest of the day, y'all. Peace.